The first thing you'll need to do is tell Mudstack which folder you want to use. The folders you select here should be folders that contain files you want to manage on Mudstack. These folders can be located anywhere on your computer or come from drives connected to your computer. Now that your folders are selected, you're going to see a File Explorer view showing you all the folders that you have added to Mudstack. You can tag and organize your files while also having the ability to version control them inside Mudstack. As you incrementally save files, Mudstack will allow you to commit any of those saves to create a version, allowing you to add titles and descriptions so you know it changed. When you start working with others, Mudstack provides several ways to resolve conflicts non-destructively without the complications of locking and checking files in and out. You will also see relevant metadata and be able to tag and assign files to libraries. Use libraries for whatever suits your needs. Sprints, teams, asset types, projects, and more. Because you can have the same file in multiple libraries, this is a very flexible way of organizing your assets. Within a library, you see a filtered view of assets belonging to that library. You can also add a description to your library so its purpose is clear. The real utility of Mudstack comes when you want to take all the work you're doing locally and start collaborating with your team. For that, you need to sign into Mudstack Cloud. Now that you're in your team context in the cloud, you get additional features. For example, you can see when files that you're subscribed to are updated. You can see which files, if any, need your attention because they're either out of sync, a conflict exists, or files you've been working on locally have not been synced. You will also get notifications about which files you need to look at urgently for your team, either files you've been asked to review or files that have changes requested by others. So, how do you go about moving files from your local context to the cloud? Take this file for instance. You've worked on it locally and now it's time to make sure your team has access to it. It's as simple as a single click. And it's now on the cloud. Now you notice that while you are working on this file, your teammates have added a bunch of other files that you don't have. You decide that you need everything in this folder. And that too takes a single click to sync the folder. Mudstack also gives you a lot of options when it comes to review and feedback on any file. So let's take a look at how that works. The Asset Viewer allows you to look at the contents of a file and examine several channels of information without having to download it. It also provides the complete context into the history of a file, all its comments and discussions, as well as its entire version history. Next, I'd like to show you Team Libraries. Like local libraries, Team Libraries are units of organization for your assets with some additional intelligence like a health scorecard that shows you just how many assets are approved. You can sync entire libraries with a single click. Our asset management, version control, and collaboration tools combined with the fine-grained access controls we offer makes Mudstack a very attractive solution for most game studios.